Hi, today I'm going to show you how to create music shortcuts that allow you to play music that you download from your internet or you receive from your email and you saved it in your iCloud drive and you can use this shortcut to play those music. Since it's in the iCloud drive, you can separate those music into folder and you can have it play non-stop. Okay, let's get started by go to the shortcut app. Pro shortcuts. Shortcuts. Okay, first you want to make sure you want to be on the, under the My Shortcut tab. Tab bar. Selected. My Shortcuts. Tab. One of three. Selected my shortcuts then tab go one to of three. Create shortcut. Create shortcut button. Create search for apps and actions. Search field. Uh, activate the search field. The keyboard should come up. Then you search for file. Search field is editing. Search for apps and cap C cap F U I L E actions heading. Append to filter, save, get file, button, heading, added, get file to shortcut, add action, And button. you want to make sure. Documents, show document picker, switch button, on. The show document picker actions available. is off. Off. And whatever the folder you put your songs in, you want to make sure you direct to that folder. So... Right now, it's under shortcut. You want to make sure your folder is in the shortcut folder and separate it by the other folder between songs, category or artist, depend on your preference. Error if not found slash shortcut slash example txt to insertion So my point folder at name end. is songs. So here I'm going to type in the word songs. And follow by the slash. S O J N G S number two slash songs. Go, go, cancel button. And that take care of that. Now let's go to the next action. Search for apps and actions. Search field is editing. Which Search is for the apps. get item from list because you want to get this item from the file app uh, from the folder from the folder that you choose so i'm gonna search for item list cap i y t e m item l o delete o i s t list button head rows list choose get item from list button added get item from list to shortcut below get file documents and since Show i'm playing from the top song the first song so i want to make sure i it direct it to get the first song from the list documents er documents scripting get item from list action heading get first item from file okay now you ready for the next Actions action available. search for apps and actions S insertion this point at will end. be the first of the repeat so that way it repeat for each song in that folder cap r e p e a t repeat with each button heading added repeat with each to shortcut below get item from list scripting get first item scripting repeat with each item in item from list okay here actions available item from list you want to swipe down for the voiceover user so that way you can go to edit item from list Edit items item from list and go to clear because you can't use that variable. You have to direct it to access the file, not the item from list. Selected file rename selected file size selected script clear button. So you want to go to clear clear scripting repeat with each item in items. Okay, now you want to swipe down again. Edit. Edit item. Oh, items. And now you choose of 
Magic variable. Attachment. PNG. File. Select magic variable button. Scripting. Get. First item. From. File. Actions available. Then now you want to choose magic variable. Documents. Error if not found. Magic, var magic variable. File. Button. Magic variable. File. Scripting. Repeat with each item in. File. There you go. So now you want to make sure you get it from file. Otherwise it doesn't work. Okay, now you're ready for the next action, which is play sound because you want e you want to play each song in that folder. Search for apps and actions. S search field is cap P L A Y S play S play sound button. Hit added play sound to shortcut below and repeat scripting. Repeat with each item in file. Okay, you want to make sure the play sound is within the repeat with each loop so you want to make sure you move up one time to be inside the repeat with each scripting play sound action S play sound action so Hitting. here you swipe down actions to available move up remove action from sh move up then you move up one time and now you within the repeat with each cross so now you're done that's all you need to do for the play from the top play from the first song to the last song in that folder in the specify folder and in this case i specify the folder to be songs and i'm gonna go to next next button Next, text field is editing shortcut name. Insertion Since my point, folder start. say songs, I'm just Actions gonna say available. play songs. So if you have like the folder name to be, you know, like dance song, you can say play dance songs, or you can separate by the folder name and create as many shortcuts as you can to satisfy your uh, music preference. Cap P. L A Y S play cap D cap O E N G S and now you want to go done done and now when if I run the this shortcut it will start playing my first song and continuously to the last song in that folder uh I'm not gonna do it because I have like a hundred songs in that folder so it's going to take me forever to complete the whole shortcut. But it will be understand that it will play the whole 100 songs continuously unless you stop the shortcut yourself. Okay, that's it for today. And please subscribe, click like, click share, and support me if you like my videos. Thank you for listening. Audio tube. Bye. Audio tube. Control center.